What's going on guys, Rain and Stormwake here bringing you another Assassinate game. Pretty awesome Assassinate game actually, as you can see. There's a couple decent level people in here, Texas Bad Ace, I know him from ACB and ACR. He's a decent player. Um, and basically this is going to be kind of competitive, but not really, like so semi-competitive I guess. And this is a really good match I had. Um, I'm really, really loving assassinating this game. I'll say it again. Um, it's it's just awesome. As you can see, I'm trying to figure out who it is here. By process of elimination, I figure out that it's this guy. By the way he's walking and just the way he looks to be moving away from me. I try to get an acrobatic kill, but he exposes me. So I'm forced to bait him, and I'm going to start off the game with a brutal escape, focus grab kill. And when they're this close to the edge, you can get the meter to go up, so that was... Fortunately for me, a silent focus, or a silent, silent focus, grab kill. So I see here, I wasn't sure who it was at first. Then I figured out it was this guy way too late. I was trying to, I was trying to win the lock, um, and just get a kill. Like I, I try not to bait as much. Like I really don't like baiting. I really love the ACB style. So I mean, especially when my abilities are down, I just go for the quick kills. Even if I have to chase kill you, like I really don't care as much because I'm using uh, a seven streak. So I mean. When I don't have abilities up, um, I'm, I'm really aggressive, uh, especially because of like the smoke bomb 100 second cooldown. Like I feel like you can be a lot more aggressive in this game, and it's it's great. I mean, I really didn't like how passive the other game was. Um, I mean, everyone just like tried to bait each other, and that wasn't very fun for me. Contested kill. As you can see right here, I get a poison, and then I get a contested kill, and right here I'm going to get a knife stun. I really like how knives work in this game. Uh, basically, ACR knives um, like they'll root you in place, and then like your kill and stun range was reduced for a certain amount of time. And as the duration of the knives wore off, your kill and stun range would start going up again. Um, but in this game, they work a little bit differently, and they have like a root time, and you can actually increase the root time, or you can you know increase the cooldown or whatever. I haven't increased the root time yet, but I'm definitely thinking about it. I kind of like how fast my knives come back, and I'm not sure if 2.5 seconds... I mean, I'm not sure if I need 3.5 seconds, so basically I'm just kind of debating that right now, whether I should be worried about uh, increasing the root time or not. So I've yet to decide on that. Um, as you can see right here, I can do nothing about this guy bulging me, so I just get my hidden silent focus. Off to a great start in this game, 5,500 points, and let's see how much time has went by so far. 728, pretty good. On track for a 20k. As you can see, I don't have abilities. Well, I do have knives, but I'm basically just trying to, uh, I'm trying not to bait. Um, but if people do lock me, I will, I will stun them, obviously. <laughs> um, and if I have a smoke bomb and I'm near a place where I can get a grab kill, uh, I'm going to take advantage of it. This is a really, really cool map, by the way. I, I, I really like this map. I actually like most of the maps. Um, not a big fan of Northwest Passage. I don't know why. I really don't know why, but I just I don't really like that map very much. Oh, I get screwed over really bad right here. That, that knife that he threw prevented me from getting a stun. And that was, that was just really unfortunate for me. That, that, was, like, that was like a troll knife. A <laughs> perfectly timed knife to screw me over right there. So uh, that's one of a couple things that went wrong for me in this game. But, I mean, overall, had a pretty good game. This was very fortunate right here. I could have gotten a poison off, but I decided to just go for the kill. Um, poison's really useful for situations where you need to kill several people at once. So sometimes I don't choose to waste it. You see, this guy's going to start a chase with me, and I'm going to get a quick corner stun here. I know there's more people coming. I take this opportunity to grab a poison. I see this guy. I kill him. And more people are coming, as you can see by my compass. I see this guy. And I try to get a hidden kill here. I believe I get it. Yep, hidden kill there. There's another guy coming up. I turn around, spot him coming up. He locks me, so I smoke him. Now I'm going to get a focus kill. Looking around, see if anyone's coming. Doesn't look like anyone's coming. Just going to grab my focus, silent. I get locked, I make my way to the middle, I do have knives, I do have one defensive ability, so 
so I'm going to see, try to spot him. Okay, there he is, right there. And <laughs> he tries to pull off a disguise after I already have him exposed. I'm going to sit on the bench here, get a hidden kill. As you can see, someone else is locking me. Doesn't really matter. I'm having a great start to the game. And, oh, there he is. Yeah, that, there's no getting away from that. No defensive abilities, no time to run. Uh, as you guys might notice, I'm using resistance. And while in the previous games, I would say resistance is kind of a noob ability to use in Assassinate. I mean, it's not the most terrible ability, but like, I feel like overall cooldowns was a lot better. And uh, people that use resistance, like, I'm sorry, but I think you get stunned too much if you're, you know, if you're forced to use resistance. But um, in this game, it basically reduces your contested kill time, so it is a lot better than it was in the other game. And I really, really like that, so you'll see me using resistance a lot. Um, I might try overall cooldowns at some point, but for now, resistance is just where it's at for me. I was wondering where this guy was, and then he comes climbing up the railing right there. kind of scared the shit out of me. I was just like, oh my god. Um, and then he uh, he decides to do the, you know, the rolling jump at me, so he gets a drop stun. And I know there's more people around. I don't know where they are. There he is, right there. I'm going to grab a silent hidden on him. Get my ground finish. And I'm pretty sure I've already got an extreme variety like a long time ago. Oh, no, there it is right there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's funny. Um, so yeah, grab another stun with my knives, get my poison off. I'm trying to figure out where the last person is. I do not see anybody, so I just start running around. Um, unfortunately, I run into a third person right here and die. That was that was really unfortunate. Um, still at a really nice pace, 14,200 points. Oh man, like this game could have been crazy. And, um, yeah, so, let's see, 3 minutes, 30 seconds left. See a guy here. Looks like someone's about to knife me. So I drop my smoke. That guy gets killed. I think that was the guy that knifed me. Oh, no, looks like I'm poisoned. Hmm, interesting. So someone poisoned me, but it was okay. I got two kills. Texas Bad Ace. Okay, yeah, that, that's the other, that's a decent player in this lobby. Um, I actually came into a lobby, like, right before I got into this, and he was, like, 20 to 5 or something like that with, like, 8,000 points. So he definitely knows what he's doing. Like I said, uh, this lobby's not full of just all noobs that have no idea what's going on. So I was kind of, I was kind of happy with this match because I got an 18 point, uh, 18.8, I believe. So it was pretty good. Get a nice acrobatic kill here on Texas Bad Ace, I believe. Or maybe that was the guy I just killed before that. Oh yeah, that was the guy I just killed before that. Okay, never mind. So I knife send this or I knife this guy, hop into the hidden group, grab a hidden kill. Oh no, didn't get the hidden. Oh that sucks. Oh well. You know, these Indian guys like there's two Indian males and they they kind of confuse me. Like they're like they're not that similar, but like just because I'm not used to all the personas yet, they're just they kind of they kinda of throw me off sometimes. Like this guy and then where's the other guy? Let's see, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you when I see him, but... Oh, wow. Yeah, the the slide kills and the slide stuns are back in this game, <laughs> as you can see. Um, even when it looks like you're running full speed and you're like, oh, I'm good. You know, just someone comes out of nowhere and just zoom kills you. So, I mean, overall, this game is just so much better than ACR. It still has its problems. Um, I'm really hoping they'll just, you know, fine-tune it, you know, fix a few of the bugs, and this game is just going to be fucking amazing if they do that. So, I mean, we'll see what happens. Um, so, 15.6k, minute and 43 left. Uh, I still have a lot of time to get a good score. Uh, the ending of this game doesn't go really nearly as well as I thought it would. But, that's alright. I mean, no big deal. I get a nice, brutal escape knife stun here, right next to a hidden group. Obviously going to grab the silent focus. And poison. Doesn't look like anyone else is around. I'm going to make my way up here. I thought maybe I could get a grab kill, but they weren't coming this way like I thought they were. He, he's in a hidden group right there. I'm just going to back off. Um, it's a lot of people around, so I kind of I kind of play more defensive if there's like a few people near me. Oh, that was, that was almost bad, but it worked out. I'm definitely going to die right here. That's okay. 18.2k with... I think like 40 seconds left or so. I don't know, I'm just estimating right now. Let's see. Yeah, 45 seconds left. Okay, so this, you know, this is looking like it could be a 20k. I'm pretty, I'm pretty stoked right now. Um, unfortunately, the end of this game goes really bad. Oh, I see you, sir. This guy is going to unlock me. 
give me an escape, and then I'm going to mercilessly hunt him down. He looked like he was like looking behind him or something. Did he lose track of me? I don't know. That was really weird. All right, so right here, here's where things go bad. Like 19 seconds left, 18.7k. I get my knife off. I'm going for the stun. That looks like max. You know, that looks like stun range, but apparently it wasn't. So I'm going to end this game with 18.8. I'm not able to get anything else. That would have been probably a 19.5, possibly a little bit higher. So a little bit unfortunate, but overall, I'm very happy with this match. Uh, it was a full lobby. Uh, quite a few people that had you know, somewhat idea of what they were doing. So I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I'll see you next video. Hopefully it'll be something besides assassinate. Peace out!